gods engraved on rocks, rock carvings in Tannum. The coastal village of Tannum is in western Sweden. Coastline rocks which emerged after the Ice Age now lie in the forest inland. In that landscape you can see a unique artistic and cultural heritage. In this rocky area there are over 40,000 rock carvings in about 360 locations. The rock carvings date back to the Bronze Age, more than 3,200 years ago. They were carved over a 1,000 year period. Before language was written in script form, pictures depicting hunting, fighting and rituals were carved in a symbolic style. Some of the carvings were painted red after they'd been discovered. Here's a picture of a circle possibly representing the sun and two women. They could be priestesses of the sun god. Or else they could be goddesses carrying the powerful sun. The rock carvings give us a vivid idea of the religious beliefs of people at that time. This image, representing the power of life and fertility, resembles a modern-day abstract work, and many 20th century artists were inspired by primitive or prehistoric works. In this carving, the circle drawn between the woman's legs is believed to represent the womb. Carvings of a wide range of godlike figures are found on these rocks. This god has long arms. It could suggest he's looking after the whole world. This could be a god in a horse-drawn chariot, sending lightning bolts, and is perhaps an early kinsman of the Scandinavian god of thunder, Thor. This kissing couple is believed to represent the sun and the fertility goddess. This carving symbolizes the arrival of spring. The most frequently found image on these rocks is the ship. And the museum's curators continue to discover more images, more carvings from long ago. They cannot always be sure exactly what the picture represents, but they know it's a piece of the puzzle and part of our common history.